Hi all, this is Holly again. Today I'm coming to you from the Boston Intercontinental Hotel. I haven't been traveling much lately, so not too many hotel reviews. But I wanted to share this one because I got a nice room compliments of a tip from Kurt Morse, which was slide some money to the front desk clerk and ask them for something nicer. So I gave him a 20 and asked him if he had something different and unique. I don't know that this is different and unique, but it's definitely a lot nicer than your standard hotel room. Starting with the very large restroom, which is about the size of my condo bathroom. I mean, sorry, my condo, condo bedroom. Yeah, I can probably put my entire condo bedroom into the bathroom. So quite nice, can't complain. Bigger mirror than I ever really want to see myself in. And onto the very large corner room secured by my $20 donation to the desk clerk. Lovely wall of windows. There's an office over there, so you don't really want to open the windows. Though one guy has a giant panda bear in his cube, and someone else has, I'm not joking about this, a stuffed squirrel in the window of his cube. But the thing that's particularly interesting as I look out the window is this giant net thing over this park. And it's gotten me curious of what is this giant net for? So either it's the world's biggest butterfly net, okay, it's a possibility, or they've gone uh, divergent, if you've read that book, seen the movie, and people are supposed to jump off at the top of the building, land in the net, and slide down to the bottom. Or they're wondering if maybe these green trees aren't going to have pretty fall leaves, and so maybe they're just going to drop the net, and those fall colors are, are going to cover up the green leaves, and they're going to fake a fall, possibly. Or maybe they've got a lot of crazy people, and this net's how they're planning on rounding them all up, just drop it on top of the park. Anyway, those are my thoughts on what the giant net is for outside my window. Also like the proximity to the Palm Restaurant, Chris Massey, you'll appreciate that. And it's in sort of viewing distance of the water. You'll notice that I'm wearing something akin to, I don't know, it's a sweater the size, it makes me look like the uncle in Despicable Me, a big blocky sweater. So it was 30 degrees in Boston this morning and I don't like to be cold. And my client that I'm having dinner with this, after, this evening wants to go for a walk before dinner. It's 30 degrees. We're going to go for a walk. Great. That's what I do for my clients. Anyway, hope all of you are having a great week. I hope it's sunny and warmer wherever you are. And that's it. Greetings from Boston. Have a great day. Bye.